Hey everyone, today we're gonna do an unboxing from Saddleback Leather. Um, here's the box, you can see it's pretty beat up. <laughs> hey, you know what? We all know there's leather inside, so it's just fine. Um, so this is going to be the Large Urban Tote from, <laughs> Large Urban Tote, that's hard to say, from Saddleback Leather. And uh, this was sent to me, but the pinions I have are my own. I am excited to actually use this tote to compare it to all my totes from Saddleback. I'm going to be borrowing some friends and just make sure I have as many as I can to compare for you. So today is just the unboxing, and then we'll have another video very shortly with a comparison. Uh, mainly sizes, weight, how they kind of work on somebody who's 5'5", um, five five, like how I would wear them. Okay, let's do it. I like started unboxing it without pushing record, but this is as far as I got. Um, go. <clears throat> it's a big box. It says, um, it said four pounds on the label, but the tote's not four pounds, just the box. Let me see. <clears throat> that was the label, and here we go. And guess what color it is? If you all said the same thing, you are wrong. They sent me tobacco. The joke is, um, I'm grateful for opportunities to review bags from Saddleback, but unfortunately, I always get a chestnut color, which isn't my first pick, but is beautiful. My backpack, my drawstring backpack's in chestnut, and I'm actually like, I kind of get it. I kind of get the love for chestnut. But my favorite is tobacco, and they send me the bag in tobacco. Wow, it's bigger than I thought it would be. It is called the Large Urban Tote. <clears throat> Here's a bunch of white noise of a plastic bag. Let me open it up. <clears throat> wow. It's a pretty color. Here we go. Let's see. And what you need to expect from these bags is that they're going to have some scratches already and some marks. That is the name of the game with Saddleback Leather uh, tobacco bags. No worries for me, no complaints. Can you see what I mean? Like, I think this one actually is a scar. Looks kind of like a scar. But I love that. Put it and suck it. Mm -hmm. And we're in. Here's the inside. One pocket, no closure, pigskin lining. But it actually kind of feels a little floppy already, doesn't it? And one exterior pocket, thoughtfully curved down. I really like that. It helps you get into the pocket a little easier. Uh, the straps are not adjustable. But I love, I, I mean, okay, this seems weird, but like this is a very simple connection point onto the tote. Um, and I really like that. And I appreciate the spacing from here to here. Maybe I can make it more flat. It's a nice distance. Oh, look at this. We got a key fob that was hanging out on this side. Oh, look at your lighting today, guys. You can see everything inside. Cool. And the straps look great. I think they're an inch in depth. Wow. So are you excited to see this reviewed with a bunch of my totes? We're going to review it with the, um, the Urban Tote. Um, we're going to review it with the, the leather tote, <laughs> uh, which is the one that I got 
Um, you'll see it in tobacco. I got it in chestnut. I traded it for tobacco, but it has the adjustable lengths right here and the integrated handle. So that one's going to be compared. Um, I'm going to borrow my friend's simple tote. Hey Jen, thanks for letting me borrow it. Well, I hope it's Jen. It could be Tanya. A lot of my friends are buying leather bags now and I have all these people I can borrow from if they let me. Um, and then what other totes? We'll just have to see. I, I want to compare them so you kind of have an idea. I know not all of them are available right now to purchase, but um, you know the used market is plentiful with uh, used bags that you can purchase. This one is, um, they had a limited run on it, but I did ask Saddleback if they were bringing it back, and they are. They're gonna bring it back in limited colors, but it will be available if it shows that it's sold out. This is really pretty. I got tobacco, yay! <laughs> Oh, okay. I'm going to use this tonight. It's rainy here, so I think it'll be perfect for the rain. Uh, thanks for watching, everyone. I'll see you later.